love for the game that I have, I never thought would grow as much as what it has. And I grew up watching football, but now playing it, it's just to a whole new level. The Melbourne Football Club is a place I call home now. My name's Alicia Newman. My mom's from Sydney, in the Redfern area, but I grew up in the western suburbs of Melbourne and I play AFLW for the Melbourne Demons. The thing I love most about football is just that family culture, um, knowing that you've got girls that really enjoy your company as well as you enjoying theirs and um, people that you always want to be around um, is something that I love the most. So I had the privilege of um, helping co-design um, our first Indigenous jumper for Melbourne. I did that with Mandy Nicholson, which was an absolute pri privilege to help create. The inspiration and meaning behind the jumper is everyone's come from a different path and we're all there for the same reason, and that's to play footy. Kicking the goal of the year is something that I would never um, expect to do, um, considering that I've only played for, for two years. I would still, to this day, cannot believe that I kicked it. Um, and the amount of times I've watched it still doesn't make me realise that I've actually done it. So, um, yeah, stri extremely humbled and privileged to do it. And yeah, I'm just glad that it went through. Mum's been a massive support um, to me um, and for me, not just me, but my siblings as well. So um, mum's been there through everything. Um, she's been to every national carnival I've been to, paid for everything, even if she didn't have enough money for it, she'd find it. So um, yeah, my, I've, I owe mum um, a lot and I know that I will never be able to repay her for it. I've actually never smoked before and probably um, the biggest uh, reason why is um, my mum actually got lung cancer um, about 11 years ago now um, from smoking um, so that's definitely pulled me away from that but um, yeah she, she come out the other side and she's all um, she's in remission for 10 years so um, yeah she's doing very well but yeah that's a, the main reason why I don't smoke. So please don't make smokes your story. This segment brought to you by Don't Make Smokes Your Story.